I love a good Cinderella story, who doesn't? And Peru is on the way to being that Cinderella story. Now Peru took out Uruguay in penalties in the quarterfinals this year. Then they took out Chile, the winner of the past two Copa Americas, which was kind of confusing. I was just I wasn't sure why it was being kept on the 2015 and then 2016, but I read all about it and it explained it to me. So this should be fun to watch. Honestly, with Brazil just being Brazil, um, this Brazilian side isn't full of a bunch of clowns like the team back in 2014, which Germany completely obliterated. Like, they just mopped the floor with them in that game, 7-1. Can't forget it. But this team now has Jesus. They have more. They have players that their club teams rely on. Like, City relies on Jesus. Chelsea relies on Willian, even though Willian hasn't really been performing. Liverpool, Firmino, Neymar, you know, always. Thiago Silva, always. It's just Coutinho. Coutinho is a great player. This team is just more professional. I like them. I like them better than the last couple generations. Plus, you have Alexandro. You have Dani Alves still. I still love seeing Dani Alves play for Brazil. So, it's a great team. Oh, oh, oh. And most importantly, we got rid of Julio Cesar and we have a world class keeper, Alisson. Which that's the that's honestly where most of my confidence lies with Alisson. So this final should be interesting. I'm definitely gonna watch it. I don't know if Peru's gonna make the upset. We shall see. <sighs> poor Argentina or as I should say, poor Messi. I should more more say that poor Messi. Because that team, that team was, I don't know, that was just a watered down Argentina. But Messi dropped out in this semi final. Lost to Chile in the 2016 and the 2015 final after losing to Germany in the 2014 World Cup final. Damn, that's rough. I don't even know anymore. But hey, this is an opportunity for Brazil to grab another trophy or Peru to win their first trophy since 1975 so we shall see look out for my next video guys I'm posting it about Mexico and the USA Gold Cup final until next time